What's up guys and welcome back to Minecraft PlayStation 4 Edition on our way back home. Look who I found. Now, I would really like to shear this guy, but I don't have any weed on me. And I'm worried that running away is going to despawn him, because that's happened before. But he's going to be helpful, because one thing, he is pretty rare. And another thing is that, um, what's it called? I need his wool for another achievement, which is getting all 16 colors of wool. So unfortunately, buddy, I just need your wool. There you go. I'm sorry, but the pink sheep is pretty awesome. Uh, from what I know, it's actually pretty rare, too. But we got a lot of cool things we're doing in this episode. If you missed the last episode, which you totally should go check out, because it was... Oh, I thought I saw a pig. I thought it was another pink sheep. <laughs> okay, um, let's go back and get all these cows. But um, if you didn't see the last episode, we got quite a lot of awesome stuff. I have a lot of interesting goals to get done in today's episode, so hopefully everything works out our way. But for now, it looks like it's just about to become nighttime or daytime. Not really sure which one, but seeing how I see no monsters, I'm guessing it's becoming nighttime. Uh, yeah, it's getting darker. Definitely is getting darker. So let's get out of here. Let's get back to the house. Hopefully safe safely get back to the house that would be very preferred but for now you know let's get back there all right so we're finally back home and i have a few things i wanted to do in today's episode first off you know we got all this new coal now which is nice and awesome we have two new stacks of coal we also have 19 iron which is great so what we're gonna do is we're going to um start smelting that iron with the six coal that we have here just because it's sort of bonus coal so you know there's no big deal with it so with that being said we have one two and then three, four, five, six. So we need, I think, two more full stacks of coal to get ourselves that um, other one, or that last emerald. But maybe I'm wrong, because we also have 31 or all these. So it's definitely worth heading over to the village again today and trying to get ourselves all those emeralds. But for now, I wanted to get one of these diamonds, not a bunch, just one of them. Uh, for one very specific reason, I would like to build a music box, because that's yet another achievement we can do here, is make a music box and then play some music on it with all the music discs that we've gotten in today's episode, so, or yesterday's episode. <laughs> so let's, uh, uh, can I not? Oh, there you go. So this should work if we go wherever there's a music box. It might be back here. Yep, okay. And where the recreational area. Right, there we go. There's a music box made. We'll just put it right here, because it looks fine here. Uh. Um, excuse me? <laughs> What's go? Oh, you know what? I think it's because there's carpet here. There you go. And then we just need to, uh, do this. There we go. It works. And we get the achievement music to my ears. That is awesome. Okay, then. So, we should probably... I know some people have been noting that it's sort of annoying that my chests are so unorganized. I just don't take much effort into doing it, but if it really does annoy you guys, I will try to fix it up soon. It's just been so focused on getting the game completed and just getting farther in it. So, I'll make sure and be sure to uh, get everything cleaned up very soon. But for now, let's get all this stuff into my inventory and try to make our way over to the village in a moment. Oh, this music. I love it. It's beautiful. <laughs> Let's check out the enchantment table though. I have 26 levels in enchantment. Um, and let's see. So, the thing is about the enchantment is that it's a little nerve wracking because you don't know what you're gonna get until you get it. So, I'm just gonna try to get the highest thing I've seen so far is 14. So, let's see if we can't either match that or do a bit higher. Um, because another thing is to get 14 or get full 9 hearts of damage off. What is this? Um,. Plus seven attack damage, Bane of Arthropods. Oh, Arthropod. That's a spider, right? All right, then we're gonna have to try to deck a spider as hard as we can the next time we see one. Because another achievement, <laughs> I'm really hoping that we get on a roll with the achievements today, is that we can um, hit an enemy for nine hearts of damage. So if we see a spider, we just gotta be ready for him. I'm hoping that's what an arthropod is, because it would make sense, right? <laughs> Either way, let's head over to the uh, village, and we'll try to see if we can't get ourselves some sweet emeralds. Alrighty then, villager friends. I would like to order some emeralds. Now, the dude who usually gives us the emeralds for the beef... Oh, it's this guy, usually. Hey, 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 where are you going? It's not him. <laughs> Imposter! Okay, where is he? I think he's the smith, so maybe he's actually in the smithing area. Is there a smithing area for this, uh... Oh, look, there's a farm here. What do you know? <laughs> I didn't know about that, but is there even a smithing area for this village? I guess there isn't, so I don't know what that guy's purpose is, but, um, we're just gonna look for him. Are you him? Nope, you were just who we talked to earlier. He's like, what do you want? Just following me around like that? Um, is it you? No, get back, get back, get back. Here, uh, uh, okay, not you. <laughs> okay, and you? Nope. Um, 
Maybe it's that guy because he's all fast. Uh, where, where is he? Please don't tell me he like died or something. Oh, is it this guy? No. Is it this guy? No. <laughs> Come on. Oh, what are you doing over? No, you're not. You're not him either. Look at this guy in this little crevice, and it's still not him. Where did he go? I really, really, really hope he didn't die because he was like our best shot at getting this. Oh, this is nerve wracking. I've been looking all over for him. Hopefully, he's just sort of tucked away somewhere that I haven't looked yet. I don't really know. All right, I've been searching high and low for this villager, and I haven't seen any, like, indication that he's here. I don't know how he could have died. Maybe a creeper snuck in at some point in time and took him out because he's different from all these guys. I think he would have the uh, darker black apron because he was um, a smith or something like that. Oh, this is a shame. Because look at this place. This place is totally torn up as if there was a monster here. So... I'm gonna try to figure it out. If not, then we might be out of luck here. Like, I tried really hard looking around for different guys who might give me different stuff for emeralds. The only one who really gives me anything in exchange for em or gives me, you know, emeralds for exchange for anything is the guy with the fish. And it's like, fish is hard enough to get in this game, so I don't know how that's gonna work out, but this really does put a damper on our progress. We're doing so good. He really must be gone. I've looked all over the town several times over, and even now when it's dark, you know, it's easier to find stuff, or to find them because they go in their own houses, I thought, but he's not here, which is just such a pain because it's like, I couldn't really have done anything to help protect him any more than I did, could I? You know, I mean, what are you doing down here? No, you're still the uh, scientist who wants to give me stuff for a compass. I don't know what kind of creeper could have done this much damage, though. I didn't know creepers would actually explode in the game without me being there. There's a bunch of insane stuff that has me really disappointed. Either way, let's take care of the skeleton dude I see over here. He has a little hat, so I figure maybe he might be uh, worth taking out. Come on, there you go. What did he give me? He just gave me arrows, okay. I'm really bummed, if you can't tell. <laughs> well, let's at least take care of the spider. Hopefully that'll give me the nine damage um, achievement. At the least, ready? Boom. Um, I don't know if it did. Uh, not looking like it. Okay, leave me alone, Mr. Creeper. I have no mood for you. There are so many enemies all over the place, and they're all, like, surrounding the spiders. Our luck just turned completely on its head, and that's such a bummer. Oh, gosh, yeah. This isn't working out for us. Um, yeah, he must be gone. Hopefully he's just on vacation or something, comes on back, and it's like, hey, the zebra caught for me when I was gone. He's my favorite customer. <laughs> but for now, I don't know. That's sort of like, we were so close, we had everything we needed to get these emeralds, and now it's sort of not possible. I don't know, I'll look for, you know, oh gosh, no, 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 I'll save you, I'll save oh, you killed another one, you monster, why didn't he close the door? I have no clue, and you, close the door, buddy, you're gonna end up like your friends, don't do that, okay, promise me, promise me you won't do that, okay, yep, we're all out of ideas here, and because none of them were really, except for the except for the dude who will, you know, accept fish, which not really all that helpful. <laughs> the fish are pretty hard to get on their own anyways, but let's just get back in here, double check with you. Nope, oh man, that really stinks. Ah, uh, baby zombie, I hate these things. I really, really hate these things. I hate all this, oh gosh, don't let me die here, game. <laughs> oh man, and now this dude's attacking me like he is? That's not cool, ugh. All right then, so I'm almost in the mood to just go adventuring and find a new village where hopefully our luck will be better. I don't know, like, I don't really know what to do at this point. Oh, there's another puppy, though. Hello, puppy. Uh, I don't really have any bones on me, though, unfortunately. I'm pretty sure. Uh, yeah, I don't have any. Okay, then. So for now, I guess we'll just keep adventuring. Maybe we'll find something else somewhere. Um, yeah, we'll go off this way. I know we have an adventure this snow biome all too much, if at all, so maybe it'll be worth touching upon. Um, we won't be super duper in depth exploring because, I don't know, maybe we will. <laughs> it shouldn't be that hard to understand where I'm going. It's just a matter of hopefully finding a village, you know? Another one would be great to find. But <laughs> I'm just sort of flabbergasted. I'm so disappointed that we got that down on our luck when we were doing so well. At least we got that one achievement, the music to my ears. Hopefully we can find more soon. At this point, the achievements get pretty darn tough. I know we need to, um... What else do we need to do? We need to, of course, get to the end, where the ender portals will actually be very, very helpful. Which I was glad to, oh gosh, there's so many spiders now. I didn't have any earlier, now I have a ton. And this still doesn't give me the Iron Hearts achievement, though. But either way, it's like, 
I know that we have to get to the end, which is going to be another helpful thing. With all those emeralds, we could have went to the one dude who gave us emeralds for them. And then that would have been awesome. It would have been like a good combo with everything. Because he would have given us an emerald for like at least like two sets of 12, I think it was. So, or like for every emerald, or for every 12 emeralds, we would get a ender pearl or ender eye. Which would have been awesome because that would have been plenty to get us going. So, all right. Um... Let's see, I don't see much of anything else here, so we're just gonna keep running. I mean, it's always fun to adventure new places. I had a lot of fun last episode, but it's just, oh man, I can't explain how, well, you know, disappointed I am that it just didn't work out, how, how he died at the worst time. He was chilling there for the longest time, you know? You know, like we'd always go by that village and everything was fine, but not anymore. This is a shame. I guess all good things have to come, out of the, uh, come to an end, and it just came to the end of the worst time possible. I'm glad that we got a, um, a thing for our uh, diamond sword though, like having an enchantment is pretty cool. And seeing how there's a lot of spiders, it is pretty useful to have it for that. But let's just keep climbing. This is interesting to see some new stuff like, wow, this area is really pretty. So that's nice. Is there a creeper chasing me? Okay, for a second I thought there was. And that wouldn't have been pleasant. <laughs> All right. But yeah, one another thing we wanted to do was try to find a saddle. Um, We have to dig down for that or find a dungeon. Um, either or might not be too easy right now. This dude's trying to get me. You shall not, my friend. You should not, because you're not actually my friend. I'm lying to you. <laughs> There's nothing that hurts more than emotional distress, huh? Okay. Um, let's go. Uh, okay, that was a good one. <laughs> Wasn't expecting to not get hurt there. Oh, I got hurt there, though. It all balances out in the end. But there is another um, sand biome off this way, so we might as well go and try to tackle that in a moment. Um, like, I have all this coal now for... No real use, I have six stacks of coal. Okay, let's keep going though. We gotta go up here, up here, up here. Uh-oh, I have a big mountain to climb now. Uh, that might have not have been a good idea. That's okay, that's okay. I mean, it's just a direct route with everything. I'm just worried that a monster might, might try to climb on me on my way up. But that's okay, I think we'll be fine. Okay, let's do this and that. Aha, uh -huh, okay. But now, here comes the hard part, is that I'm all out of blocks. Well, now I, now I have one more. <laughs> I am pretty bummed, but I'm looking at the bright side. We get to adventure new lands and stuff, you know? That's always fun and cool. But let's, uh, oh, here we go. This is a huge, uh, what's it called? Uh, sand biome, desert biome. We can only hope to find a village down, you know? It's like there's no guarantee, which is the hard part. There's no guarantee that we're gonna find the goods, so. Probably should have brought a bed with me, but I wouldn't want to die out here and then be respawned and then it'd be awkward. I mean, I don't know. <laughs> okay, hop on up here, and there we go. And now I just gotta keep running. Uh, so far, not so good, I don't see any more villages. I feel like it's just easiest to find a village in the sand biome because you know, it's flat, so you can see everything that's ahead of you. Of course, we might find some in the plains biome, but right now, th oh, there we go, there's a village, okay. And I'm 100% certain this isn't the village that we saw before. The, gr the world isn't that small of a circle, <laughs> or a spear. Wow, this one's much bigger too. Okay, our luck might turn around right here, guys. But either way, it becomes morning once more. The moon sets for yet another time. We find a big hustling and bustling village. Look at this place. Alrighty then, we'll have to explore this a bit more in the next episode. I'd like to thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed today's episode, make sure you give it a like, share with your friends and family, and comment in the comment section below. What do you think about some of the crazy things we've done in today's episode? And I'll see you guys next time. Bye-bye. Down with the creepers! Down!